welcome back to SHOT Show 2020 with Airsoft Station. I am here with Nigel from Umarex USA and he's going to be going over these new blocks that they are going to be have coming in. Nigel, what do you have for me? What do you guys got coming out this year? I'm really excited for what you got. I am too, for sure, man. So, uh, a new line of blocks for 2020. Uh, the first one I want to start with is going to be the Glock 45. Now this essentially is going to be a black version of the 19X uh, with the addition of some serrations there to the slide for a little bit better grip. Uh, the cool thing about both the 19X and the 45 is it has the updated hop-up system from BFC. So instead of having to take the slide down to you know yep, to change view weights, yeah, uh, now it's going to come with the included tool, twist left or right, and that's going to adjust your hop-up. So you're no longer having to field strip your gun to get to that hop-up accessibility. So I'm really excited about that. Um, in the middle here, we're going to have our deluxe version uh, of Glock offerings. This is going to be a 17 Gen 3. It's going to be a 34 uh, Gen 4. Uh, now these are going to be a CNC slide. Uh, it's going to come pre-installed with the steel hammer. Uh, it's going to have the CO2 magazine, and then these will both come in a Glock hard carry case. Um, and that's very nice to have, guys, with that upgraded trigger in there. Yeah, yeah, and I will note that the the, the, the steel hammer uh, kit will be available later on. So for everyone that's bought the BFC 19s, the BFC yeah 19X uh, or the 17s, if you want to upgrade your gun, have a little bit stronger of a of a hammer, we'll have that available. Absolutely, for you. absolutely. It's Longevity of your product. That's you know? it, man. That's it. And then, of course, uh, we have the, the updated Glock 17 uh, Gen 5, and this is going to have the updated hop up adjustment on it as well. It's so, a very handsome looking product. Right it there. is, man. I'm excited for these. I know there's a lot of, uh, a lot of hype, a lot of want on those, so we're excited to bring them out for 2020. Yep. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. So, I understand you guys got a new SOP mod. This is going to be the new stop mod rifle that you were actually putting out. Nigel, sure. what, what do you got going on here? Yeah, dude. So, um, you know, we're discontinuing the caliber, which is going to be the key mod, kind of 416-ish receiver okay, line okay. of Avalons. They're fun, a little front heavy, uh, just kind of a slow mover in the U.S. market. I it seems like M-Lock has kind of taken over the market. Exactly. And I think that's kind of the way the market's going to go in the future. Absolutely. It's going to be so, that M-Lock. Yeah, so we wanted to have, um, you know, some other options to kind of fill those holes in the Avalon series. So it seems like everyone's kind of going to the space gun, right? Yep, everyone's kind of going space gun. Right the, the, the billet style receivers, you know, how different can we make the profile look? Uh, so we just kind of put the brakes on and said, well, what about just the classic, you know, M4 configuration and Sotman, um, you know, Old Faithful. So if you want something classic uh, with the quality of BFC and especially the quality and performance of the ECS Avalon gearbox, here you go. The cool thing that we had requested is that it has the brake in the barrel here. So if you want the CQBR. Oh, you guys are sneaky. I love I it. That. Look at this guy. Boom. So there it is. Guys. He knows what you want before you even know it. Milsim. Milsim. There it is. I love it. Yeah. So I'm really excited for that. That's really yeah. cool. Yeah, That's man. That's awesome. You well, can have hey. That. Oh, oh. Yeah. Bye, guys. No, thank you so much for your time, man. I appreciate it. And that's going to be from Umarex here at SHOT Show 2020. Thank you guys for tuning in. I appreciate it. We'll see you in the next one.